guys. The phrasal verb we're going to do today is take up. And we're going to do two different meanings of this phrasal verb. So the first meaning is to accept. To accept a challenge, to accept an offer that somebody has offered you, or a challenge that they have challenged you with. So let's do an example. Let's just say you work for a company, and somebody wants you to leave that company and come work for them. But you don't want to, because you like your job, you get paid well, and you're comfortable there. But this person really wants you. They like you, they like your skill, they like your technique, they like your ethics, they want you there. So they give you this great offer. They say something like this, hey, if you come work for me, I'll pay you double what you're getting now. And I'll give you five weeks paid vacation. And you only have to work six hours a day. And you think, oh wow, how could you say no to that? So you tell, you tell whoever you're talking to, you might say, I'm going to take him up on his offer. I'm going to accept his offer. Past tense would be took up or took him up. You might tell someone, I took him up on his offer. Or I will take him up on his offer. I will take him up, past tense, I took him up. And again, remember, phrasal verbs are not limited to one way. Take up. Took up is the actual root of the phrasal verb, but here you have inside a word inside. Take him up. Take her up. Take them up. Take us up. Take us up on our offer. Another example we could say we could use is, let's say you're at a river, a river that's kind of deep and with a very strong current, and somebody challenges you and says, "Hey, I'll give you five hundred dollars if you go across that river to the other side." And you think, "Oh, you know what?" $500, it's a little bit dangerous, a lot dangerous, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. I'm going to take you up on your offer. I will take you up on your offer. I will take you up on your challenge. I accept your challenge. And the other way for take up is learning something. You could say take or take up. For example, you could say I am taking up karate lessons. My son is taking up swimming lessons. I will take up German lessons. So... Today's phrasal verb, take up. If you like this video and all my other videos, please click like, please click subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know. Leave a comment. Michael from Uzhgorod, Ukraine. Have a nice day.